Well, welcome everyone to our first episode of our podcast. It's Art So Wonderful and Poetry Pioneer. Um, yes. I'm Candace Owens, and we are so excited to be here today and talk about some things that we've been doing and that we're going to do. And I will turn it over to my co-host, Bruce, over here to, to yes. introduce yourself. Oh, hey, Candice. Nice to see you. And I'm Bruce Wilson, um, co-host with uh, Candace Owens from Art So Wonderful. And we're very excited, and I am very excited to be able to do our this podcast with everyone that's going to be uh, showing um, we're hopeful around the whole country and possibly in other parts of the world. And uh, we have so many friends around the world, and, and we have so many uh, friends in this country and who admire all the things that we do and Candace Owens for incredible uh, poetry that she uh, writes and reads and presents. And God, I think she's going to start us off with one, but uh, go ahead, Candace. Ken, what's, what's first? What all doing? right. So, well, good catch there. We need to start out with the poem. So, <laughs> today is the day. Today, everything will be okay. Today, I will see color, even if everything looks gray. I will take a deep breath and clear my airway. I will be mindful of all I do and say. I will enjoy each moment and create a new pathway. I am grateful for not going astray. I am grateful for not getting distracted by the dismay. I'm amazed by the peace I get when I pray. Today, I will let love be my guide and lead the way. Today is the day. Nice, nice. Uh, that's nice. I really appreciate you uh, writing those poems and, and actually reading them to us all. You know, give us a uplifting, you know, within ourselves and our mind, bodies, and soul, and make us feel like, you know, like, you know, we're part of this world and that we are something other than um, whatever we might think we are, and other than just waking up each morning and going to work or whatever we do, whatever we do in this world. You know, poetry for me means a whole lot for my life, livelihood. You know, just words are incredible, you know, and, um, one word can help you with your life and your um, goals in life and help you with your day and just make you feel better as well. And so I think that's some of the reasons why we, you and I are, are, are doing this podcast and our cable shows is to help uh, people who might need a little a word or two or who might want to share a word or two with us and just um, be a part of what we do and help us reach others, you know, make the world better. You know, that's I think that's our goal is like... <laughs> How many times have we said that? I know. <laughs> uh, so go ahead, Candace Owens. All Please. right. Well, we're definitely going to leave this world better than we found it. I guarantee you that. So mm -hmm. that's, I will start out with saying, so we did our first contest, which was really cool. Um, and we had an, an well, it's not contest, competition. I don't even want to call it a competition because no. it's not really competition. We did a worldwide global um contest hosted online, I guess, where we had poets that could submit um, a poem about anything, anything they wanted. And we had a great turnout. And so we're going to go through that closed yesterday on March the 20th. Wow. So we're, we're going to go through that, Bruce, and figure yeah. out what we're going <laughs> to do. And we did decide that we're going to do first, second, and third place and have multiple winners. Yes. So, um, and everybody but, wins something. Everybody gets something from us. Yeah, everybody's you know, just, getting a certificate of participation because, you know, that's huge. And uh, we did have global participation. There was people from multiple different countries. Uh, so that's super exciting. Um, we're going to plan on announcing the winners on April 1st or 2nd. I thought about April 1st, and then I'm like, that's April Fool's Day. Oh, it's a good yeah. day to announce it. So <laughs> I thought about going with the 2nd just yeah. to do yeah. that. Yeah, let's, uh, yeah, let's do that. But um, so that's kind of the goal with that. And we'll do it via social media, email, Instagram. Um, and then I, I'm sure I'm going to try to post it on the Poetry Pioneer website. I don't know if you'll be able to do the same. Yeah. Arts. Wonderful. Sure. But we'll advertise yeah. it everywhere we yeah. can. Teddy, Teddy will be able to put it on our website. Yeah. No okay. doubt about it. Yeah. And um, each winner will get to speak on our next pod. Not the next one. Wow. The, yeah. Our next podcast. Well, um, you did. Okay, well, we'll get yes. that. We'll, okay, because yeah. maybe you sent me today. Maybe you sent me today, but I don't um, know. I think I, we had talked. Hold on, I did send it to you, but I sent it. It was. Let me pull it up. Monday, April the 29th was our goal. Oh, oh. Uh, April's well, I, National Poetry oh. National Poetry oh. Month. So that's kind of a good thing that we're okay. kind of yeah. 
I see it. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. So I'll, so I'll set it up. That has been, um, that was, I mean, I'm pretty, I'm really excited uh, about all of it and we're going to host more of these. This was just the first one. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. Our next one, I think we're going to shoot for May 1st and have it open for 30 days. Um, and we're going to keep it simple, write a poem about faith, you know, like write something. What is faith to you? Is it faith in, you know, you go outside and you're like, the sun gives me energy and I know every day I can have faith in that. Or is it, I walk outside and, you know, I see my, you know, whatever you have faith in, we want to hear about it and write no doubt about it. it means to you. No, that, that's, thank you for um, getting, picking that topic because what, which, what, one of the things we want to do too with, um, Poetry Pioneer and Art So Wonderful is that we want to um, like have a, like a, a, a understanding about, you know, we, we have a direction we're trying to follow within. And the, the direction is uh, how can we make the, ourselves better? How can we help each other? How can we make the world better? How can we live better? How do we feel better? How can we make ourselves feel better? And so so these will be some of the topics that we're going to be um, presenting on um, Candice's incredible Queen, Queen Candice. Candace. <laughs> Queen Candace. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Um, you know, we'll come up with all these topics. Maybe I can uh, think of one or two, but um, definitely uh, I'm so excited about the faith topic. And um, and and I think uh, a lot of people um going to give them something to think about, too. You know, what is faith? And like you said, like you asked the question, what is faith? You know, and, uh, and, and you know, yeah, when you said that, I had to think about, hmm, what is faith? You know what I mean? Because it means so much. I mean, it, it means so much to us. And it, and it's just that, wow, faith, man, you know, just faith in so many things, faith in the higher power, which is your, who is your higher power, who wakes you up every day, who, who, um, who you consider as your, um, your, your higher power, your God or, or, or whomever, but, um, that, um, is your faith, you know what I mean? And if you follow by, I mean, you follow the faith is your, the, um, Holy Quran or the Holy Bible or, you know, um, passages or um, scriptures, and um, and oh, talk about the. <laughs> I'm so I'm so bad. I go off so so many ways, but you know, faith could be. It's going to be a lot of faith in um, in um, Candace Owens' affirmation book. What's the name of this book again? I, please. Yeah, tell me. so we. Have, I'm actually almost at the end of it. So soon. Well, not soon. Well, it'll be pub yeah, published coming soon. Um. So it is called the New World Light: Poetic Affirmations to Create Heaven on Earth. Oh, so, um, I strongly believe that uh, you know our reality is a state of mind, right? So we can choose to see Earth as heaven, or we can choose to see Earth as hell. And so, I think that hmm. how you start your day and how you start your mind that every morning, even not any time you need that pick me up, and it's like you know what my thoughts are down here. So I'm hoping that my words can help people transform their thoughts because I know as we've both talked, I've grown, you know, my first one compared to I'm doing 60 days, right? Cause I feel like 30 days isn't enough. So you really need mm -hmm. that 60 days. Mm -hmm. It's been real time. So mm -hmm. every day mm -hmm. since we have started doing what we're doing, this has been created. So this isn't a past thing. It's real time. So once I get the 60 days, we're going to publish it. And um, I'm really excited to share it. And so yeah. far, um, I did post some advertisements on it, not advertisement, but some stuff just on social media. And um, I think that the world really needs this right now. So if you are a poet or anything, just we're really excited to to share and just anything like that. Yeah. And the a, and a, and a wonderful thing about what we're doing is that, you know, it's not it's not about us. You know what I'm saying? It's about the people who we serve in theory, mm -hmm. you know, and, and so we we're we're very excited to hear other people's affirmations and poetry and words of wisdom. You know, how excited are we, Candace, about that? You know what I mean? You know, because we, we want to continue to get better and learn <laughs> ourselves, you know, yeah. and like like Candace said. That um we want to have you on our cable. We have a cable show as well. It's our uh, so wonderful cable show and poetry party. A cable show that's coming up. Um, I think I'm changing the date, but um, but we have a, we have a cable show too, as well as po um <clears throat> podcast that we want you to be a guest on our show to tell everybody about what is you know what's faith to you, what's what poetry mean to you, how words change your life, 
how you feel good each morning, what makes you feel good each morning, whether you like, you know, you go outside and scream and holler. You know? <laughs> I know Candace go out there and mess with her chickens and her bees oh and <laughs> go to walk towards that <laughs> a, a real pond that's that's right there behind her. That's a real pond. And uh just just do her thing, you know, make her feel self so, so feel better. You know, you know, she told me a story about her at lunchtime. She'd go out and watch, look at the birds fly and make, come back in and feel so much better, energetic and ready to go. You know what I mean? You know, we all need these uplifts for ourselves throughout the day. And um, mm -hmm. whether it's saying a prayer, you know, we all should pray all day long about to to our higher power about how we can make, make ourselves better. You know what I mean? And pray that please help us make ourselves better and give us the words and guidance and spirituality and and so yeah uh, and yeah the way you said better i think is a good way but i think that what we have society what we've kind of got away from is being the better version of ourselves than we were yesterday instead mm -hmm. of better than someone else like oh, no, 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 no. we have to stop and it's mm -hmm. i do it all the time i mean i will naturally just be like oh well i should be further because this person did that and it's like you know what I'm doing better than I was yesterday. So today is uh, progress, right? Progress mm. is success. And I think that that can be expressed in so many ways mm. and, you know, in so many forms. And it's like, you know what, just, just get better. Right. No and doubt about it. If you did something yesterday that when you got done, you're like, you know what, I shouldn't have said that. I shouldn't have done that. I didn't feel like it was right. Then that's when you need to think, okay, please let me do better and then do better. No doubt about it. And like we say almost, probably almost every day that um anybody, you know, well, some people like um wake up in the morning and they think that uh uh just like yesterday, you know what I mean? Same old, you know, same this, that, and that. <laughs> but uh it's not true, you know, because you know, yesterday you might have woke up with a headache, you know, today you might not have that headache, you know, you know, and the, and, and people's like, I don't know what's good today. You say, What's good? You know, I'm like, what's good? And they be like, uh, you know, this, that, and other. But the good thing is that you woke up this morning. How good is that? <laughs> Ask nothing could beat that in a day if you win seventy billion dollars today. Just so having the lottery is closed and you gotta wait till the morning and you don't wake up in the morning to get that seventy billion. What's more important? You waking up or the seventy billion? Um, you know, so waking up each morning is the best thing that can happen to you. And guess what? You can design your day. Damn. Good is that? You can design your day. You can say, today I'm gonna do this. Today I'm gonna feel this way. And then, and as if you, like Candace said, if you go a little stray a little bit, you could use a, you can um repent or 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 uh, do you know repent and think about ways that you can make yourself better. And um always know that you know you're always forgiven for whatever that seem not don't seem to be right, and that uh, that you are um your higher power God's person you know when we always use the words can is not too great to measure because we are too great to measure we don't we don't try to put a, a limit or, or anything on what we're what, what our worth is i can't you do it if you're too great to measure and your barns burst open and your cup overflow as the bible said you know how in the world can you put a measurement on that can you imagine your cup just keep overflowing and you no matter how much you eat at your barn it still burst open you know and you're too great to measure how can you measure that I don't go by, I don't measure that. I just know that I just want to keep good, continue to better. And all I can do is um, um, get better by um, learning from Candace and everybody in this entire world. And so, so thank you all and everybody for helping me get better each day. And I'm, I'm you know, I'm not the best. I'm trying, you know, I, I make mistakes. And so all day long, I had to forgive myself. I'm like, please for, forgive me for saying that. Like you said, Candace, thinking that or... <laughs> It's it's weird, you know. We live in a world that, like, you know, that kind of have us be in certain ways, you know. But we have to re remind ourselves that, you know, we're we're part of higher part, and we need to stay on that narrow path. You know, what I'm saying to keep keep getting better. So, where are we now? Where are we at right now in on our show? Um. So right now uh, we got to finish. It looks like we're doing good. We got to finish up. Um. Just talking about the second competition there that we're going to have the next one so we are going to charge an entry fee for the next one which is going to be ten dollars but the prizes are going to be bigger so we're going to offer bigger prizes and the person will also get to be a feature on the cable show and podcast um 
I don't know about, oh, sorry, just one of those. We'll fix that. But yeah, I think just, we're going to have them on the podcast. And so that's kind of our goal is, you know what, part of writing poetry as I've learned through doing this is speaking it too. So, you know, if this comes from you, we want to hear it come out of your mouth and we want you to speak it and we want to share it with as many people as possible um, and hope that it makes a difference. And so we plan on announcing those results in June and I don't want to go too far into it because I know that seems like so far from now. Um, but we're really looking forward to more competitions. And then something that I did do because, you know, I, I do, I did found an actual poetry pioneer is, is an actual company. So we created a GoFundMe page. If anybody is interested in, you know, donating, whether it's a dollar or anything just to help with our competitions or support travel or anything like that, uh, that would be great because, you know, eventually that would be something I'm looking forward to doing is not just doing this virtually, um, you know, look, thinking big, right. As you said, we're too great to measure. And so, you know, but sometimes when you're first starting out, you just need a little help. So if that would be appreciative and then, um, then we're going to, all this information will be on both of our websites, the poetry pioneer.com and art. So wonderful.com. And I know Bruce, I don't know about you, but I would love to hear other people's suggestions, you know, like about what they think would be good, positive topics that we could discuss that would be that would uplift humanity, right? What? No doubt about it. Yeah. What could we use? Um, and, you know, just, I, I like maybe come up with some different giveaways and. Yeah, no doubt about it. And there's nothing too is about the up, um, charging, you know, um, not I don't say charging, but um, adding, a, um, you know, we don't charge nobody, nothing, but adding a, 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 a like an interest fee to our contest is all about for the contestants. It's yeah. not about, it's not about us, you know what I'm saying? No. It's all about how can we make our show and our podcast and our contestants and everything we do better. So, you know, I know we say we can't just, I had to go against the grain a little bit right here. I know we said, you know, well, we didn't say it. We just stopped. Oh, maybe we shouldn't say how many people, how many contestants kind of submitted their poetry, but maybe we should. <laughs> it's up to you. Well, I think uh, only because people can probably can understand more, a little better, why we need to uh, charge a uh, entry fee. And, and So we, in less than 30 days, we had over 80 entries. So some of those had multiple poems. Um, and it was a very open contest, but saying that, you know, I do work a full-time job. I am a mother. Um, and so you also have things outside of that. So it's going to require a lot of our time yeah. set and go through, the, which we're so excited about, like we're yeah. super pumped about it, but you know, to be fair, everybody is going to get the same amount right. of attention. So whether you're number one or you're a number of thousand in our mm -hmm. contest, right. we are going to set and we do it together. Like we talked about, we're going to schedule a time. Right. And it's not us clap. We're going through each individual one. That's Everybody's right. going to get that ease certificate. So That's you right. get at least individual yep. custom attention. Mm -hmm. And it's not just for clout or likes yeah. or social right. media. This is legit. I've been writing poetry since seventh grade. Um, I've invested money to develop a company. Sure. You, we're, we're, we're pumped. And right. we just want to, you know, give everyone what they deserve. So and plus, and plus and yes, thank you, Candice. Thank you so much. You know, I uh, really appreciate, you know, all the work you do and, and all the between work you do as a person, as a mother and, you know, and, all, you know, all the things who you are, you know, your job and everything, yeah, you know, you got to deal, yeah. got to deal with me, you know, and I'm, I, <laughs> oh my God. But anyways, so because of the, um, so many entries, contested entries, when we, we looked at in short period of time, Candace and I were like, oh God, we got to we have to increase the the prize money mm -hmm. for the winners. So we increased it to first, second, and third. It was just for first place winners. Yeah. Now it's the second and third. We had to do it because it is had to we had to it had to feel right for us. I mean, for that for wonderful people like you to submit your um your poetry to us and um to appreciate, you know the work we're doing and helping trying to help you get yourself out there in um in the world and people can read your poetry and you could be on our cable show and our podcast to talk about yourself you know what you want you know your your, fu your future how you see the world faith you know the light shining bright on you um this how are we going to make this thing better here in heaven on earth how can we do it you know what yeah. i mean so and so it's only fair 
that we increased the um we increased the um prize money you know to, from from first place to second and third now so yeah. so now we thought wow you know with these many contestants you know what I mean that we you know we need to um really um raise some funds and keep it going and keep have some more prizes have some uh, I think we're gonna give have a giveaway I think we you say we're gonna have some giveaways and stuff like that and so um and, and not to mention this the uh, the certificate certificate to everyone that participated you know uh, who can show to any hang on their wall and put yeah. on their put on their um show to their teachers show to their mother and their family how you know how they've been a part of our uh, <clears throat> poetry pioneer and our so wonderful cable shows and, and a part of uh our our network and um, how we what we're trying to do in the world to help people with their goals, dreams, and aspirations, and learn about how to um help other people. And so it's a big deal, you know what I mean. And so, so it's only fair that you know we all help help, help each other. So, so where are we? Where are we at now? I think we're we're close to pretty. We were about thirty minutes in, so we've been going a pretty good time Woo-hoo! now. Yeah. All so, right. Um, mm. I think I do. I had one more poem. I'll read at closing. Okay. Well, before you read that poem, let's um um so um so um I think our next show is going to be uh, I don't have the confirmation yet, but I just um suppose well we better wait. I think it's the twenty ninth, right? April twenty ninth. But yeah. Um. Yeah. So we'll wait for that. Um. Um. So um. I, I know we talk about so much, you and I. I mean, it's so fun, it's so weird, and we talk for hours and days, you know, about um, the work we're doing with uh, with the poetry and um, and all the things that we want to do, how to reach people, and you know, the faith wise. How can we help this world get better? Let's talk about that a little bit, um, Candice. You know how the world's going through this devastation. It's going through this. Oh, man, it's just like people are killing each other. You know. People are starving, you know. The environment is bad, you know. What I mean, um, it just it's it's so sad, you know. What I mean, and and um, and we all we try to do is help uplift people, get make the world better in, in the ways that we can. In the ways that we can is help each other, right, around the world. And um, maybe a good one word can. I know one word can really, you know, like happiness. You know what I mean, or love, or you know, be kind, like your poem, be kind. You know what I mean? Um, can help people just feel better. You know, just feel better more than just, uh, you know, drab and, you know, I don't feel like doing it or, you know, just for themselves. I mean, um, it's, you know, you know, I, I, you know, I, I don't have all the words, but I'm sure that, um, so, so let's talk about the world for like a couple of minutes. I mean, like, what do you think? You know what I mean? Man, I mean, I'm not going to say where we're headed because we, where, where we figure it's headed is going to be um really good if people, our followers, just stick stay with us. And we have a lot. How many followers do we have, first of all, that can that can reach us right now? Um, How many what? Followers that we, that can reach us right now. Um, I think I got about 2,000 right now followers. Mm-hmm. Um. So, but I do advertise using just basic mechanisms, um, not basic, but using the algorithms and stuff. And I think in a 30 day period, I reached about 1.1 million. Um, Mm -hmm. So, and that's worldwide, that's not USA, but um, that's a pretty big amount, right? That that's, that was in, that got in front of 1 million people's faces and it cost me a little bit of money, but I know that in turn, that's helping someone down the road. And, and I know because it's viewable, right? That means that people are interested they're clicking and so it helps um and it's not even about it's just like wow and it's 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 people who you know will message me frequently like thank you for your words i found your page everything's mm-hmm. so positive mm-hmm. i like um the content i like the cause, you know they'll offer do you want to you get these messages do you want to buy followers do you want to do this well then you end up with junk i'm like no i want real people and real people only right. if you follow me it's because you want to follow me i'm not paying um, a third party person to give me fake followers so that I can get more numbers. No doubt about it. It continues to grow. It's been three years. You know, I started out with one and I and that was like my stuff <laughs> really falling in on my personal page. Um, but it was like, you know, and <laughs> here I am. Like, here you are. Here know. you are. Here you are. It's Ken Disney Owens, the queen. Green Owens. But it's wow. just, it's clear, I think, as you talk about the world right now, mm-hmm. I mean, I can't tell you the last time I, I used to 
I grew up watching the news every day. So I knew what the weather was like, what to kind of look forward to, you know, that's kind of, and, um, you know, this is a news channel, but I think it's all about what not news channel, this is a podcast, but you know what I mean? The, right. It's all about what you choose to feed yourself. And so I choose, you know, I'll turn it on and watch the weather and stuff, but I, I'm in tune with the world, but I'm also in tune with myself, myself more and my, as we say, faith or higher power. Like mm -hmm. I'm constantly checking in with how I feel, why I feel that way. Is it because of me or is it because of something, you know, something I saw? Um, you know, am I sad because I personally had something happen to me or am I feeling it because someone else is sad, um, which is totally okay. But at the same time, this world can be so much more than it is. Like, and as people, we're kind of just settling for the narrative we're being told. It's like, yeah, okay, this is what it is. And, you know, when people do speak up, they're so angry and aggressive and frustrated, which is all natural. Um, but we need to instead be like, let's take a deep breath and pause. Mm -hmm. Like, what can we do, like you said, to make it better? Can we buy some land and plant some trees so that we make more oxygen? Can we start each having our own gardens and growing our own food? So then we're not having to depend on all the stores for the food sources. Like, is there ways that we can go back to our natural ways, but still be modern? Um, those are the things I think that we really can look at, whether through poetry or just in conversation, um, is those things. And so I hope that we continue to do that as we go. But Well, you know, one thing um, <clears throat> is that you have to, personally, um, Candice, you have no choice to make sure things happen the way it's supposed to. You just, you have no choice. You, this, this, it just, you know, you, you have no choice. You are the light shining bright and you, you have no choice. First, for, you have no personally choice, but other people might have a choice, but not, not you. So you have to continue to do the work you do because you have to, you know, there's no, you have no way. I was <laughs> born for this. Right. <laughs> you were bred for this, born and bred for this, you know, so you only, you're only going to get better each day, each moment, you know, and they, that you share yourself. And thank you for sharing yourself. People don't understand that, that you're, sh you're, you're sharing yourself is with all of us is like so important. They, they will get it though sooner or later though. And how powerful you are in this world. You know, you really are. Um, but well, uh, I just got noticed that our time, I guess, we're hitting about close to the 45 okay, minutes. Sure. So. so no doubt about it. So yeah, we can so, talk forever, though. We can, we, love, we can talk forever. So. You, know, <laughs> you know, we can. But, you know, um, so are you going to put on, you're going to let the people know about our next cable show date or, yeah. or our, our podcast? So both, tune right? In, we will have our next podcast um, April the 28th. It will be recorded, but it won't probably be live on the website. 29th. 29th. Good catch there. Um, 29th. It won't be live for a couple of days, but once it is, it'll be viewable on YouTube and both the CCTV website. Um, mm -hmm. we'll, I'll upload it to my website too, uh, poetrypioneer.com. I don't so. know. It's, it's accessible many different ways. And um, so that's our goal with that. And we will, we are so excited to announce no doubt about it. and read no doubt about it. and figure out. Um, no doubt about it. Yeah. What our next so uh, look up uh, our so wonderful.com as well. It'll be mm -hmm. on our uh, website too. Um, and so I just want to thank you, um, Candice, so all the way from Kentucky, and I'm all the way from Vermont, yeah. you know, for uh, for us doing this uh, work that we do, and and we love people. And so, um, you can you can send us out of here, go right ahead. Okay, so um, this poem is entitled Can a Dream Become a Reality? Can a dream become a reality? Can it be something we feel, taste, and see? Yes, it can. Manifestation is part of our birthright and destiny. Do you believe me? Having faith and staying positive is the key. Happiness can be found with that within. There is no fee. Start by self-talk and saying, I will do it instead of maybe. Stand up for what you believe, even if others say you are crazy. This world can be overwhelming and hazy. Take a break, relax, and re realize you are not lazy. Even weeds are beautiful, like the flawless daisy. Nice. <laughs> nice. So take us out. Go All ahead. right. Well, I want to thank you again for partnering with me. And no about it. I am just, I don't know. I can't explain it. I, I'm full of just even more light and love and positivity mm -hmm. when I've seen all of the people. So thank you to everyone who entered and took the time to submit your work to me. It was uh, not me to us, to every, we are so grateful um, because 
it, it just shows that what we're doing is of service, that what we're okay. doing mm-hmm. is needed. And um, I'm so, I guess, pumped to see us grow and do our next podcast and just keep going. Mm-hmm. And only place we're going to go is up. So just come on with us, people. Just keep following our journey. And um, mm-hmm. it would be nothing right. but fun. Right. And just look out for our, uh, our next contest, uh, which is the, when it started again. Um, that will be starting May 1st and May I will 1st. make an announcement on my Instagram. My Instagram name is poetry pioneer 2021. Um, you should be able to look me up by that if you want to follow me on there, but, um, yeah, all of that, we'll have it all on your website, my website, we'll have it, um, everywhere that people can find. So if you want to connect with us, you should be able to find us one of those ways. Okay. Just take us out of here. Candace. Take all right. May here. God bless you all. And yes. we're all too great to measure, as you no, say, Bruce. So. No doubt about <laughs> it. All right. Have a good rest of your day. You Thank too. you, everybody. Bye. Bye.